How's it going guys and welcome you to Barca Variety and as tomorrow we have a huge huge game coming up and we seem to be saying that a lot in recent weeks but it really is a huge game tomorrow and Ronald Koeman speaks ahead of the title decider versus Atletico Madrid. We're going to be talking about his words in full length and in full detail. So let's get started. If we do get started with his words on the game itself, he said, During a season, there are always ups and downs. We have recovered a lot of ground to be where we are, and we did not expect it three months ago. Now I understand that this is a day that we can that can be an important step. We have to be very very ready and this team it really has fought to get here but it was such a shame that we couldn't go top of la liga but now we are still in the league and we are still fighting and we have to understand that in this season we can still win the la liga title but then he does get a question do you think tomorrow's game will be decisive? Do you think it will decide the whole La Liga title race? And old Coleman, very, very interesting from him. It seems like he's not trying to put the pressure on his players. He says, I don't think tomorrow's result will be decisive. Important, yes, but not decisive. Well then, another interesting question. What happened with the appeal of the red card? Because Barcelona appealed that red card to La Liga and they haven't got a response yet. And the first one was rejected and he did not go on the bench versus Valencia. And Ronald Coleman said, I don't know why they haven't heard something yet. I would like to be at the game, but if not, it's not a problem. Our staff has shown their great during the game against Valencia. And in this huge game, in this massive game of our season, in a title deciding game, it is very, very important to have the coach, Ronald Coleman, on the sidelines. But of course, we cannot do anything about it. But then, there were actually some good news with the injury touchline, finally, on Ansu Fati. Because we did speak on our other video about Ansu Fati and we gave an update on his injury. But now, Ansu Fati traveled to portugal to get a surgery a fourth surgery and it was officially announced with the club and it was finally officially announced he said i spoke to ansu before his trip we encouraged him there were some things that didn't go well because six months is a long time to be not playing football and the most important thing is that he will recover and he will be with us next season but then, there are so many rumors lurking around Ousmane Dembele and his future at Barcelona. Because after the contract rumor talks and the extensions that Laporta doesn't want to renew Dembele, he got a question saying, are you still counting on Ousmane Dembele? We have saw Ousmane Dembele on the bench for the recent four games and he hasn't even came off the bench. Is it because of injury? Is it because of his contract talks? We really don't know why. And Ronald Koeman said, it is clear that I am counting on Ousmane Dembele. As with everyone else on that list. He can be on the pitch. Lots of things can happen during a game. We will put the best team with which we think we can win the match. And it's clear that Usman Dembele is just getting some rest. Ronald Coleman doesn't want to risk him into it. And I'm so, so glad it's not about his contract extension talks. But then, a very, very interesting question. Again, these press conferences have actually some interesting questions. So Ronald Coleman got asked about the referees. And... Just basically about Matteo Lajos, who will referee this game. He got asked, how do you feel about Matteo Lajos refereeing this game? Ronald Koeman, he had a little laugh. He said, I don't think I should talk about referees. In general, the Federation puts one of the best referees for these games. We have to hope that he gets his decisions right. I think my suspension has been a personal matter against me. What I said is no reason to suspend me for two games. I think 
there is something more and that there it's a personal matter it's just itself very very interesting but then he does get a question about the signings likes of memphis depay aguero lukaku we feel heard all of those names, and of course erling Haaland, neymar jr and all of those signings but Ronald Koeman, the way he replied to this question, I love the way he replied. It was just outstanding. He said, the best thing for us is that Leo stays. Because it means continuing with the best player in the world. Of course, we're going to talk about preseason and about signings. And it's normal because you want to improve the squad. But the most important thing is that Messi stays. And this from Ronald Koeman, that is just brilliant to appreciate the best player in the world. But then, he ends his press conference by getting a question. Who do you think will win La Liga? Will it go down to the last game? Will it be Atletico, Real Madrid, Barcelona, or Sevilla? He said, we are two good teams that are coming up against each other. Speaking about Barcelona and Atletico Madrid. And we are fighting with two more teams. The style of each team is very, very different. It simply cannot be compared. I am convinced. If we win our remaining four games, we will be champions of Spain. And that, guys, these are all the words of Ronald Coleman. What did you make of these words? There were, f for sure, some very interesting questions and some very, very interesting answers. And what did you make of Ronald Coleman's words on the referee? And as I finish this video, I'll get straight to work on the match preview and I will see you then. And if you did enjoy this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the match preview.